Hey everyone! This outline is something cool that you can create with the Solidify modifier. It's essentially a two-step process, if you don't really count all the steps that are in between the two main steps, but let's show you how to set it up. I've got the Restless Armor model from Dragon Quest XI here as an example, which I got from the model's resource, link in the description. Since we're not going for photorealism, we're going to be using Eevee as the render engine. First step, add the outline material to your object. In the Material tab, click this plus sign to add a new material slot, then click New here. If you plan on only having one material for your outline, it doesn't matter how many materials are on your object already, just make sure you have it in the last material slot. If you're going to use multiple outline materials, make sure to have the outline materials immediately under the material it's going to be outlining in the list. That might sound a little confusing, I'll set up like a little, I'll put a little thing on screen, do this. And outlines can also be textured, if you want to do something crazy or have the outline have the same type of shading or, you know, whatever. Alright, switch the material type over to Emission, and change the color to whatever you want the outline to be. I'm going to use black. Make sure you're selected on the outline material, and enable backface culling in the settings dropdown. Now we're on to what I'm calling step 2, setting up the Solidify modifier. In the Modifier tab, click Add Modifier, and find a Solidify modifier. Expand the Normals dropdown, and enable Flip. Under Materials, change the offset to 1, so that it chooses the next material in the list as the outline material. If you have a whole bunch of materials on your object, and you're trying to only use this outline material, change the number to like 100 or something, just a larger number than the amount of materials. Alright, now everything should be ready, and it's time to play with some settings. If we slide the thickness setting around, we get a cartoony, hand-drawn-esque outline around our model, which looks really cool. When you have your thickness set to a negative number, the Solidify outline expands outward from your object. If the thickness is positive, the outline will be within the border of your object's edge. If we switch over to wireframe view, you can see that we're actually adding a copy of our object to create this outline. So there we have it! It's a very simple thing to set up. One thing to keep in mind is since we're adjusting the borders of our shapes, you may have to adjust how you model your characters slightly, in order to accommodate the solidify outlines and have everything look how you want. Also if you have your lines too thick, everything starts to look bad, so outline within reason. Thank you for watching! Hope you found this useful! Please like and subscribe! If you'd like to help the channel grow, share a video! We also have a Patreon! Okay, thank you for real, stay safe, I love you all, I appreciate everything, goodbye!